The Republic of Serbia is a tiny European country brimming with rich history, stunning natural landscapes and warm friendly locals who pride themselves on their hospitality. It is little wonder then why Serbia is a popular destination among tourists looking for a European destination, slightly different from the norm. Today, we're here to provide you with yet another cheat sheet on one of the world's up-and-coming must-see travel destinations, the city of Belgrade. So, without any further ado, here are our must-visit spots in the vibrant city. On a tall ridge at the intersection of the Danube and Sava rivers stands the regal Belgrade Fortress, our first must-visit location. The fortress stands dead center in one of the finest parks in the city. The park is open 24-7 and is often used by tourists and locals for a wide variety of activities, such as free open-air concerts and even dance lessons. The park is also home to the Military Museum of Belgrade. This museum presents the complete military history of the former Yugoslavia, including various historical monuments cataloguing the bitter struggle the city has had to endure in the past. A testament to the city's resilience, it is truly a rags to riches story that will certainly increase your appreciation of the old city. If you're still in the mood for some more historical sightseeing, the Nikola Tesla Museum is nearby. A testament to the brilliant mind of an engineer and scientist known for designing the alternating current or AC electric system, which is the predominant electrical system used across the world today. There, you will find out about the life and death of the Serbian hero, as well as various displays of his early works, which revolutionized the world as we know it. Skadalia Street is one way to experience what the city must have felt and looked like in the 1800s. Cobblestones beneath your feet and iron gas lights on either side of you. This old road is a real trauma. Various cafes can be found here and it is a good chance to take some traditional Serbian dishes, see live performers and soak in the vibrant nightlife the city is so proud of. This area of Skadalia is truly a unique one, as it balances its old charm and mixes it with some contemporary, making it one of Belgrade's more livelier areas. There are a number of nightclubs and bars scattered in and around the area, and is the perfect place to experience why Belgrade has shot its way up the list of top destinations in Europe. There are a litany of bars and clubs, such as Splav Club 94, River, Freestyler Belgrade Nightclub, and Boho Bar, all excellent choices for partygoers looking for an entertaining night out. Speaking of nights out, another must experience would have to be the Splavoli or floating lounges. A night out in Belgrade would not be complete without you partying on either of the two rivers, the Danube or Sava. Anchored all along the sides of these two rivers are a number of floating lounges, restaurants, bars or nightclubs, each having their own atmosphere, crowd and attractions, meaning that no two Splavoli are the same. You can go lounge hopping if you wish in order to experience each one for yourself. These remarkable venues are part of what makes the nightlife in Belgrade so unique and why so many choose to come here for a great time. How about we throw our foodies a bone? For our meat lovers, Serbia is the place of your dreams. Serbian barbecue is a must try and throughout the city of Belgrade, there are no shortages of restaurants capable of satisfying your meat cravings. At the top of our list of must try Serbian foods is Chivapi. Ask any local for their recommendations and you will almost always be pointed in the direction of a local spot they believe serves the best chivapi. The dish is a rather simple one, but as the saying goes, simple is best. In this instance, the old adage is spot on. The dish is a grilled dish of mincemeat. It's served in a flatbread, also known as somen, to Serbians, and it's best with chopped onions on the side and with kajmak, a fluffy and light Serbian cheese. Next on your list should be the Serbian snitchel, which can consist of either veal or pork. It is then rolled and stuffed with kajmak, and after that, it's breaded and fried. If you've had enough meat and need some variety, not to worry. You can give the local cabbage rolls a try. They are stuffed with meat, but you were warned, were you not? Serbia is a country of meat eaters. This is as much variety as you'll find here. Anyway, these cabbage rolls are called sama. The filling is made up of spiced minced meat with sour cabbage leaves serving as the wrapping. The contrasting flavors truly make for a pleasant eating experience. Bakeries in the city are also a must stop. Find a recommended local one in the city and try a burek. It's a pie filled with a variety of fillings. You can try cheese, meat, or even have it plain with no fillings. They are just as tasty. The most famous one is cheese burek. 
These pastries are usually breakfast food for locals, maybe because they are known to be a great hangover killer either way. It's a perfect kill two birds with one stone scenario after a long night out. That covers it for our review of the city of Belgrade. We hope you enjoyed our recommendations and if you have any of your own, don't be afraid to share your opinions down below in the comments and let us know if we left anything off our list. If you're interested in travel related content, be sure to subscribe to the channel where we post content like this on a weekly basis. Till next time, safe travels.